New technology is helping Family History fans find information with just the click of a mouse. 11 News reporter Janet Govin tells us how searching for ancestors is getting easier. Doing Family History 10 or even just five years ago was not an easy task. Taking notepads and pencils and papers and going places and trying to find records and looking on shelves and in books, it was a nightmare. I used to trip through the cemeteries and do all that and it was a lot of work. But with advances in technology and new ways of searching, family history is becoming much less tedious and much more exciting, especially with the government releasing the 1940 U.S. Census this year. It's, it's a census that there's tons of people today that are still living that are actually recorded in that census. The number of names available for search online has doubled in just the past year, and genealogists expect that trend to continue. Now that the human genome is mapped, even biology is involved in the search. Uh, there are some great advances being made in DNA technology that will allow us to find different, to uh, find people that probably came from this town. As the amount of information explodes, so has the number of people looking for it. Um, in 2002, we handled 35,000 customer help interactions. In 2011, we handled 11.5 million. And for those people, searching will continue to get easier in the future. Way easier. It's 100 times better. It's amazing how far it's come. In Salt Lake City, Janet Govin, 11 News. There are already 140,000 volunteers who transcribe written records online, and family search officials say they expect more to volunteer when the 1940 census goes live.